What's going on everybody? Math with Chris. More conversion today. We're going to look at converting 12.5%. We want to turn that into a decimal and we want to turn that into a fraction. Alright, so first the decimal. That's uh, usually going to be the easier one, at least when you're starting with percentages, although not always. But in this case, yes. So we take the number, 12.5, and in order to convert it into a decimal, we just move the decimal over two spots. One, two, and we get 0.125. That's finished. 0.125. 12.5% is 0.125. Now, if we want to convert the fraction into, uh, sorry, the percent into a fraction, well, we got to take the number 12.5, and we got to put it over our favorite number. That is, of course, 100. And now, this is sort of an ugly fraction that we're going to have to work on a little bit uh, and simplify. So, uh, we have a bunch of videos about how to simplify fractions with, with decimals in them and things like that. You can check them out from as much practice as you need. We have an entire section on them. Uh, so for here, I'm going to run through it pretty quick, though. In order to get rid of that 0.5, we're going to multiply both sides, of, of both the top and the bottom, by 2. That's going to give us 25 over 200. And now we're going to simplify that 25 and 200. Well, 25 goes into both of those, uh, divided by 25, divided by 25, equals, let's get some more space down here, 25 divided by 25 is 1, and 200 divided by 25 is 8. So that is our finished fraction, 1 8th. Let's put that in our fraction answer box. That's where it belongs, because that's where the correct answers go. So 12.5% is 0.125 as a decimal, is one eighth as a fraction. That's finished and done and correct. Uh, we have a bunch more of these to practice on. If you need, click the video in the upper left if you want to try another one uh, and see you again all real soon. 